Hey everyone, it's Ryzen, and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3 at the S, the answer, take three of this episode, because, well, I got totally hosed in my previous two attempts with status ailments. I, uh, bought some status healing items, you only want some dis poisons and, uh, dis charms and... Uh, I think, yeah, my Potter gems. I also bought, uh, amp accessories for all my party members. I gave Menace the Ice Amp one, because I prefer her to not use Garula here. Uh, in addition, I gave, I guess, the, uh, Thunder Amp accessory, because, well, I'll be using Thunder Shadows attacks here. And wait, I sense the same unknown presence as before. Unfortunately... Could it be... If you get hosed to set so much, there's really nothing you can like do, this. so... Oh well. So yeah, it, it's partly luck-based. Incoming shadows. It wouldn't be so luck-based if you could control your party like a normal game and, you know, heal status ailments off of the main character. That would be very, very nice. You know, if this was actually a well-designed game with a well-designed battle system, but no, no, it's a poorly designed battle system, so... We get to watch the AI be pathetically incompetent, and yeah. I want to scan the Harm Dancer and not the Merciless Maya. Let's leave uh, Medicine Act freely. Ikari and Junpei on heal support. Junpei will use Maraka Kaja. If the AI will actually do it, instead of throwing useless items! And Yukari will heal. Unfortunately, she does not have Meteorama for me. Uh, I don't know why, I don't know how, she almost always has it for me at this point in the game, but she doesn't. Oh well. Let's just use uh, Mazio here, and uh, the Harm Dancer absorbs Ice and Wind, repels Slash, that's a good damage. Uh, it nulls Pierce Light and Dark. Vulnerable to Lightning, has Heat Wave, Maragi, and Marn Karn, Poison Mist, and Dodge Fire. Merciless Maya absorbs fire, nulls light and dark, weak to wind, but not really. Agilal, Virus Breath, Fury Sound, Dodge Wind, and Makarakarn. Which is why I would prefer uh, Metis not use uh, wind ability, but if she uses it once... See what I mean? I want you to use Morocco Kaja. Why did he not use... Oh, I'm immediately hit with a status helmet. Immediately. Why did he not use Morocco Kaja there? Why did he throw medical powder? Why? Poor game design. Please don't charm me. Thank you. Persona. What are you doing? <sighs> oh. I, I will set you to full assault. She was using Herculean Strike for me before, last time. Now suddenly she's using Marin Karin. Oh look, Ikari's doing her job. Did you actually use Maraka Kaja? I don't even remember. No, you didn't. Why didn't you use Maraka Kaja? What the hell was so important on that turn that you didn't use your one buff? I really hate this game sometimes. I, I don't... Pull Assault, please. You see what that does. Heat Wave is his most dangerous attack. Okay, there we go. Full Assault looks like she'll actually do what I want her to do. Yeah, Virus Breath is like a demi spell to everybody. It's like a gravity based attack. Oh, so now you do it, even though you could have thrown a medical powder on that turn. I have to dispel that with Mazio. He's gonna heal Metis, that's fine. You can dispel that very easily with a nice Mazio spell. Since Takamikazuche is immune to lightning spells. I can only shake my head. So he decides to use a medicine. 
as opposed to a Discord. Great. Why not? Take this. Thank you. It's a tough one. I have no way around the status ailments, so if I get hit with them like that, I'm basically hosed. There's nothing I can do. You know, that would have been a nice turn for media, because I would have removed it myself. I could use the Onga and try and get this one guy. The Mayas are almost dead, so I think I'm going to go Orgia mode. Oh, that was nice. Oh, nice dodge. Nice, got one. Ah, eh, now it's gonna be staggered. Oh well. Probably already was staggered and I just didn't notice. I really wish you had Meteorama. Oh well. Let's dispel that. Can you actually hit them? Good. You actually hit them. Just poison yourself, please. Thank you, Junpei. You did something useful. Now I can actually attack on the next turn. Thank God I didn't get hit by a status helmet there. Yeah, Meteorama would really help in this fight, but I don't have it, so. Oh well. Go with a nice little Mazio. Not bad. I don't know why that's doing so much more damage to I guess. He might actually kill him. There we go. Meteorama yourself. Alright, I got a one this time. Yeah, there's no real trick to it other than be the high enough level to survive their attacks pretty well and uh, pray that the status ailments don't screw you over. I mean, that's all there is to it. There really is nothing else to it. Yeah, my second attempt, every single turn I got hit with the status ailment, and then eventually I got charmed and it, it was bad. It was really bad. Junpei refused to use Maraka Kaja. Metis kept casting Garula on them and missing, and it was a disaster. Wow, that was funny. Let me guess, Yukari is now going to level up. Go ahead, Yukari, level up. Huh? What, do you guys not gain experience for that? Oh no, you do. You just don't have your dialogue. Thanks. You know, I could have really used that Meteorama there. Could have really used it there. Oh well. Yeah, another problem with Metis. See that nice little power charge? She will spam that sometimes. And it sucks. It sucks horribly. A couple of attack mirrors. Precious egg. Not too bad. So, all this left is the third part of Kana. Oh, I did get uh, Black Frost, by the way. I think I forgot to uh, mention that. 
But yeah, I got him right here. I have personas that I'll need for later. Although I think I'd get rid of like Impusa and Takumitakata at this point, but I'm not sure. I'd have to look up to that look up that further. And Narcissus I guess I could get rid of at this point too. But like I know I'll need Chisa and Mothman to fuse later. Uh Kalotha I'll need to fuse way later in the game, so I might not hold on to it. Obviously I need it for Norn. Uh the third part has no boss. And just bring the exact same persona she brought last time, which would include uh, Takami Kazuche, Kusumitama, Sarasvati, uh, Floros. Yeah, that'll do it. And if you're still looking for Black Frost, pick that one up. And uh, just use whoever your lowest level party members are. Uh, excluding Metis, because you want to keep her with you at all times. So in my case, that would be Mitsuru. Hiko. Yeah, Mitsuru and Akihiko, it looks like. Unless Ken's close to getting... No. He's not close to getting Meteorama. Yeah, I think he doesn't get to, like, level 57 or something it's ridiculous. So I want Akihiko and Mitsuru. Especially Mitsuru. I gave them all their appropriate amp accessories as well. I'll eventually get an accessory for Ken later in the game, but uh, not for a while. He's going to be with me for the very end of the game. And uh, I'll want his Meteorama to effectively be a Meteorama, because I don't want to level him up that high, jeez. Well, yeah, I think that's going to do it. Uh, this was annoyingly uh, difficult to make for whatever reason. Oh, and the next level goal is uh, 47, by the way. I want to reach that for in the next section. So, yeah, let's save up here. Am I close to getting 47? Oh wow, I am. Yeah, I could get that without even needing to grind. Cool. So yeah, this is Ryzen. Uh, thanks for watching. Take care.